Are you looking for a clip software that has good quality and doesn't have an overlay for every clip you post? <laughs> If you are in this video, I got you. All right, so now we're on OBS, and I'm basically going to show you the process on how to download it, and then the setup you need for your clip quality to be good and your audio settings to be right. All right, so I'm going to use Opera GX for this. Uh, what you're going to do, you're going to search Steel Series GG Download, and then you're going to go right here to the engine except obviously and then I've right here you're gonna click I'm not gonna click it obviously because I already have it you're gonna click free download once you click that it's gonna load up here on the top and you're gonna open it and then you should be on this you, you won't see any clips here what y'all what y'all will probably see is like here like just this since you have zero clips uh you click alt and s to clip stuff and like for your settings, we'll go here, down here, and then you go over to clip settings. Duration, I have mine as one minute. You might want it as 30 seconds, depending on how long your clips normally are. And then your monitor resolution, well, I'm on stress res, so I have mine on 1440. Uh, FPS, I would just put it on 60. Video quality, I recommend high. I mean, it's also the default, but... And then for your audio settings, you're going to go right over here to capture and sound you should see all this you're going to scroll down default microphone from windows which is for me it's this one but if it's just in your windows settings already you can just put it as default same for all of these like default communication it would normally be this but it doesn't really matter all right and then once you get if you click advanced settings it'll bring you right here again but you can just click overlays and notifications when you click Alt and S, here, I'll demonstrate it real quick. This will pop up at the top of the screen. And with this setting right here, you can change where it goes. Bottom center, top center, bottom right, and top right. And then bottom left, top left, you get the point. You can do that, put it wherever you want. This is just the default. Then right here are some settings, just shortcuts, save new clip. As you can see, Alt S, you can actually change this though, if you did want to. Uh, and then start desktop capture mode. It's basically OBS. It just records your whole screen until you click Alt P again. I don't know if this is a default setting or if I put this on, but it doesn't really matter if you use OBS. Uh, this I would turn off. It should automatically be off. But I also 100% recommend. I definitely recommend turning auto clip off. You'll see this at the top if you have Fortnite open. You're going to go over to auto clip clip you're going to click it you want all of these turned off or it's going to be clipping stuff the whole game and that's going to ruin your storage so by turning this off it will only clip when you click it having this on it i mean obviously i just said it but i believe if you turn this off it does the same exact thing like it just disables all of these other than that that steel series uh i posted this video because a couple people were asking about it uh it's better than metal for y'all that use metal and you have your username at the bottom of your clip i honestly hate that so steel series when you export you can share clips but it'll have this there for a couple seconds only but i recommend just exporting your clip you can pick the file size i normally just do original since my clip quality is on high uh and if you have like the apex pro mini or any steel series keyboard you can go right here the engine you can change the color of your keyboard you can go to gear click on it change the actuation of everything uh and then sonar i'm not too sure what this is they actually do have an in software aim trainer though i personally don't recommend it i recommend Kovax. way better and there's way more options and yeah i mean i guess that wraps it up for this video this will probably go on youtube too uh so if you're on tiktok exe atrix on youtube we're trying to hit 1k anyways thanks for watching